माय डियर स्वॉन्स मैं सब गंगाधर स्वॉन के एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू द एम सी जेम्स वर्चुअल क्लास माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे इन स्टैंडर्ड टेंस हिस्ट्री वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद द टॉपिक स्पोर्ट्स एंड हिस्ट्री सो इन दिस टॉपिक विल बी लर्निंग द पॉइंट्स इम्पॉर्टेंस ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स टाइप्स ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स globalization of sports game materials and toys toys and history sports literature and movies and the last point sports and professional opportunities so by these points it is very clear that in this topic we are going to discuss about the history of the sports and at the same time we are going to discuss about the professional opportunities in the field of sports so sports combine entertainment and physical exercise this is very common thing which we know about sports that number of times we are enjoying sports as an audience and at the same time we can take part in any type of game or in sport so through sport entertainment is also there one can experience the entertainment and at the same time by participating in it it helps in the physical exercise to play is a natural human instinct and hence the history of sports begins with the origin of mankind you people already learned about this in the fifth standards evs various games have been played since the beginning of civilization hunting was indeed a way of obtaining food for the ancient people but it was also looked upon as a game and entertainment now on the screen four images are there one two three and four all these four images are related with the civilization of human being or by these images we can understand the progress in the field of sports so hunting in the fourth image you can see was indeed a way of obtaining food khana chahiye to to uske liye hunting karna padta tha but it was also looked upon as a game and entertainment day by day it was increased like sports or like a game and entertainment for other people so the ancient indian literature and epics if we people go through the ancient indian literature and epics mention various games such as games of dice that is dyut in ramayana and mahabharata also you people can find out the references of dyut then wrestling horse and chariot races and chase now here in the first one races you can see chariot races then the chase then here wrestling this chase or it includes dice sometimes and the hunting so if we people go through our religious books or epics then we can find the references of sports and by this we can understand that the history of sports is with the civilization of human being the greek were the first to standardize greeks were the first to standardize the rules of sports and organize them systematically 
sports and greeks is a very ancient equation because there only in the greek sports developed and when we talk about the rules or by organizing the competitions or systematicness in the field of sports then the greeks worked a lot in the field of sports today also number of games are there and the different different rules are there of different different games for example the rules for cricket are totally different than the rules for football or rules for hockey or rules for kabaddi or rules for many other games so the greeks were the first to standardize the rules of sports and organize them systematically they started sports competitions now whenever there is the word competitions two things are there the players which are playing in the game or in the type of any sports then they are related with the physical involvement and the audience who are enjoying are related with the entertainment so the greeks started sports competitions of discus throw here you can see horse and chariot races wrestling and boxing the ancient event of olympic competitions used to be held at olympia the ancient greek city so today जो ओलंपिक्स के गेम होते हैं और ओलंपिक्स के गेम्स जब होने होते हैं तो पूरी दुनिया से हर एक देश से अलग अलग काइंड ऑफ टाइप ऑफ गेम में स्पोर्ट्स में दुनिया के हर कोने से प्लेयर्स जाते हैं और ओलंपिक में मेडल जीतना या फिर सिर्फ पार्टिसिपेट होना भी बहुत बड़ी बात मानी जाती है सो द बेसिक ऑफ द ओलंपिक गेम्स स्टार्टेड इन द ओलंपिया विच वॉज द ancient city in greek to be able to participate in olympics and be a winner to be able to participate it is very hard to participate only aapko sirf participate hone ke liye bhi bahut sari competitions jo state level ki ya fir at national level use par karna padta and then only you can participate in the olympic games so to be able to participate in olympics and be a winner is supposed to be a great honor for sports person like number of games are there in the olympics and if you want to participate in that to aapko aapke desh mein jitne bhi competitors us particular game mein hai us particular sports mein hai unse acha aapka performance hona chahiye and then only you can participate in the olympic games and if you won that any medal then it's a great honor not only for the sports person but for the country also so this is what is the history of the olympic games but here one thing which you have to keep in mind that the sports were the standardized by the greeks and the rules of sports and organization of the systematic competitions were held by the greeks first then the next point there are a number of training centers for wrestling and other sports in our country also and in that vam shala of famous wrestlers jumma dada and manik rao vadodara then krida vidyapeeth patiala then स्वर्णिम गुजरात स्पोर्ट्स गांधीनगर खास बाग तालीम एंड मोतीबाग तालीम कोलहापुर हनुमान व्यायाम प्रसारक मंडल अमलावती श्री शिव छत्रपति क्रीड़ा संकुल बालेवाड़ी पुणे सो दीज आर द ट्रेनिंग सेंटर्स फॉर रेसलिंग एंड अदर स्पोर्ट्स हेयर वे गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द इम्पॉर्टेंस ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स वाई इट इज़ वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट टू प्ले games or to participate in the sports to play games is very important for us because it enables us to overcome suffering and 
worries nowadays our life is too much stressed because of number of things and if we want to work on all these problems or the tensions or the any kind of pressure in our daily routine or in daily type then it is very important to participate in any sports or to play a game so it enables us to overcome suffering and worries games help us to relax it helps us to relax and refresh our minds again two things are there it not only relax but refresh our minds so basically sport is the thing sport is the thing which gives exercise not only physical but mental mental exercise then it gives psychological also it gives emotional exercise also and that is why we are saying it enables us to overcome suffering and worries it help us to relax and refresh our minds games which involve lot of physical activities provide good exercise as well so again the same thing it gives us good exercise games help in building a tenacious and strong body for the body building games are very important playing games also helps us in developing courage while taking part in any competition we are challenging the courage in our body or the general type of determination and the sportsman sip it also helps in developing leadership sports person having leadership qualities are having bright future in their particular game for example the games like cricket or in football or in hockey jahan par bahut sare players hote hain wahan par jis player ke paas leadership qualities hoti hai उसके आगे जाने के चांसेस बहुत बढ़ जाते हैं जैसे टू बी कैप्टन ऑफ दैट पर्टिकुलर टीम देन द कोऑपरेशन टीम स्पिरिट इट हेल्प्स अस टू डेवलप अ सेंस ऑफ कोऑपरेशन बिकॉज वी नीड टू प्ले विथ ईच अदर लाइक अ टीम एंड ऑल्सो इट गिव्स अस टीम स्पिरिट सेंस ऑफ टीम स्पिरिट एंड द क्वालिटीज ऑफ leadership so all these are the importance of sports while studying jab hum bahut bore ho jate hain ya thoda sa stressful lagta hai to aise waqt it is very important to go out and fresh or to have uh, any game with your friends jaise ground pe jaake agar thoda sa kuch khelenge aur fir wapas aayenge to fir se hamari energy boost ho jati hai mind fresh ho jata hai suffering or worries agar hamari kuch hai तो उसमें से थोड़ा सा रिलैक्स और रिफ्रेश हम फील करते हैं सो ऑल दीज आर द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स एंड बिकॉज ऑफ ऑल दीज इम्पोर्टेंट थिंग्स विच वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द स्पोर्ट्स इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू प्ले और टू पार्टिसिपेट इन द स्पोर्ट्स कॉम्पिटिशन और टू प्ले एनी टाइप ऑफ गेम विथ यूर फ्रेंड्स नाउ द नेक्स्ट थिंग we people now discussed about the history of the olympic games and the history of the sports then the importance of sports and now we are going to discuss about the types of sports sports are of two types very simple divided into two types outdoor sports and indoor sports or we can say indoor games indoor games and outdoor games it is now in the name only outdoor jo ghar ke bahar khele jate hai darwaze ke bahar yani ki indoor which are under in jo ghar mein khele jate hai so outdoor sports indoor sports now one by one we'll study in detail about this indoor games 
इंडोर गेम्स आर प्लेड विद इन अ क्लोज इन्वायरमेंट प्लेड विद इन अ क्लोज इन्वायरमेंट एंड अ नंबर ऑफ देम आर प्लेड बाय सिटिंग एट वन प्लेस फॉर एग्जाम्पल वी कैन एड कैरम हेयर ऑन द स्क्रीन यू कैन सी देन द स्नेक एंड लैडर चेस सो बाय दीज एग्जाम्पल्स ऑल्सो इट इज वेरी क्लियर दैट इंडोर गेम्स आर प्लेड विद इन अ क्लोज इन्वायरमेंट एंड अ नंबर ऑफ देम आर प्लेड बाय सिटिंग एट वन प्लेस दे इंक्लूड चेस कार्ड गेम्स प्लेड विथ गेम्स मैन एंड डायस कैरम एक्सेट्रास द गेम नोन बाय वेरियस नेम्स एज कच्चे कावड़िया और चौक बारा और एज इंडियन लूडो इज वेरी पॉपुलर अमॉन्ग इंडियंस एंड द गेम नोन एज सागर गोटे प्लेड विथ अ बंच ऑफ सीड्स और स्टोन्स इज यूजली प्लेड बाय गर्ल्स देर इज अनादर गेम नोन एज भातुकली दिस वन यू कैन सी विच इज यूजली प्लेड बाय गर्ल्स एंड विच इज यूजली प्लेड बाय गर्ल्स आई यू ऑल द मेम्बर्स इन द फैमिली कैन ऑल्सो पार्टिसिपेट इन इट स्पेशली इन द मॉक वेडिंग ऑफ अ गर्ल डॉल एंड अ बॉय डॉल इट इज एन ओकेजन ऑफ फैमिली सेलिब्रेशन ऑन द स्क्रीन यू कैन सी द चेस नेक्स्ट वन वे टॉकिंग अबाउट द इंडोर गेम्स दिस पिक्चर विच इज अबाउट द डाइस game kind of dice game but by the nature of the picture and by understanding their clothing and the coloring of the picture we can easily understand that this period is very 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 back it also gives us an idea about the history of sports aasani se hame samajh mein aata hai ki ye aaj ki tarikh ka ya aaj ke जनरेशन का तो ये पिक्चर है नहीं तो इससे हमें हिस्ट्री का एक स्पोर्ट्स के बारे में भी पता चल जाता है चेस अगेन नाउ दिस इज ऑफ टू डेज सो बाय कंपेयरिंग दिस टू पिक्चर्स वी कैन अंडरस्टैंड द हिस्ट्री ऑफ द चेस कार्ड्स again the same thing different types of indoor games carrom very famous in indoor games type now the next outdoor games the outdoor games can be categorized into two types so basically types of sports two indoor games and outdoor games and now in outdoor games two types are there indian sports indian sports and international sports so when we talk about indian games it includes langdi kabaddi atta patya kho kho these are the indian sports in the type of outdoor games here now you can see the picture of langdi langdi kabaddi live matches are there on the television of this then this is atta patya kho kho again very famous game in the school and these are many more by these images you can understand the type of game so our Childhood is 
directly or indirectly related with these images with these games which we used to play in the school and you people now also can play these with your friends So Indian games like marbles, lagori, viti dandu or gilli danda, bhingri, bhora, fugri, jimma are quite popular here in this image you can see. Now the next point, the international games, when we talk about international games then it include badminton, and table tennis this one hockey cricket football golf polo etc so all these are the types of outdoor games in the international sports or international games Among outdoor sports, running races are popular all over the world. Running races are popular all over the world. Sprints or short distance running races are usually arranged for 100 and 200 meters. There are also middle distance and long distance races. Marathon is a long distance running race. Nowadays, in number of cities, marathons are organized by different different institutions or by organizations or by government also aur bahut sare runner hote hain jo in marathon mein participate hote common log bhi is marathon mein participate ho sakte and there is cause behind this marathon sometimes alag alag cheezon ke liye marathon arrange kiye jate hain jisme kuch social issues social cause hote hain ki loge mein uska awareness failana is the reason behind this there are also middle distance and long distance races then the marathon which is a long distance running race and other types of running races are hurdles and relay races so if you people go through the olympic games on the internet then you can see the types of running races short put discus throw long jump high jump water sports like swimming competitions swimming competitions water polo rowing and sports that combine physical exercise and acrobatics like mallakham rope mallakham gymnastics etc are all included in the outdoor sports based on physical skills so in each and every category or in each and every type of game the physical skills are different for example in mallakham flexibility is very important now the next one adventurous games in adventurous games ice skating then the skying ice hockey etc are popular games that require balancing skills so here we are talking about the skills mallakham is all about the flexibility of the body at the same time balancing but here in the ice skating and in ice hockey balancing skill is very important there are many other adventurous games which include rock climbing gliding auto racing cars and motorbikes etc then the next point is sports competitions but about this we'll talk in the next part of this lesson in the next part in the second part of this lesson we'll be learning about the sports competitions globalization of sports game materials and toys toys and history sports literature and movies on sports sports and professional opportunities in today's part of this topic we discussed about the history of the sports and in that especially we talked about the olympic games then the importance of sports why it is very important to play 
games or to take part in sport competitions because it gives us it helps us to relax and refresh our minds it enables us to overcome suffering and worries games which involve a lot of physical activities provide good exercise as well games help in building a tenacious and strong body playing games also helps us in developing courage determination and sportsmanship games needing collective participation help us to develop a sense of cooperation and team spirit it also helps in developing leadership the best example of this agar hamare school mein koi competition hoti hai to hamare team ka captain jo hota hai wo hamesha aisa ek ladka hota hai aapke class mein ka jo acche se lead kar sakta hai jisme leadership qualities hoti hai jo sabko saath mein leke ek team banke khel sakta hai so all these qualities are very important and maintain while playing then we discuss about the types of sports in that indoor games and outdoor games in outdoor games again two types national and international in indian sports langdi kabaddi atta patta kho kho and in the international games badminton table tennis hockey cricket football golf polo please subscribe the channel and press bell icon to get notifications so my dear students this is all for today thank you very much stay home stay safe take care